Welcome ladies and gentlemen to Eden Park where South Africa and New Zealand take each other on for glory. It is a one point difference at the moment between the two teams on the lock and it's all to play for in this fourth game of South Africa in the Rugby Championship. Let's go quickly through the lineup. An impressive lineup for both teams with so South Africa still without the likes of Fluid de Jager and Cheston Colby due to injury. So it should be a really cracker of a match going forward into this game. So Andre Pollard is going to start this game for us. It's all or nothing today for both teams here today. The kickoff taken well there by Ardi Sevilla. Oh, and a thumping tackle by Bonambi and Ardi Sevilla is in trouble now. He's limping off the field at the moment, so Papali is going to replace him. Such a pity that such a good player needs to go Crouch. off almost immediately. Fine. But Dalton Papali will really enjoy this moment here on his home ground. The feed in there by Aaron Smith. Ball taken out to Mohanga on the attack very early on. Now Sam Whitelock taking it in, but South Africa stolen it on the ground. Now Vali out to Lukanya. Slow ball coming out to Mapimpi. Now here's an opportunity back inside they go, but a pass is loose. And a chance for the All Blacks to recover now. Oh, pass out to the tight end prop, Laulala, and he's get driven into touch. So another attacking opportunity for the Springboks very early on in this game horrible Not throw straight. in from Bonambi and the ball goes in skew so it's going to be in a chance here for the All Blacks to relieve some pressure what are they going to do they decide Crouch. to go with the scrum Fine. very clever option there Sit. Now the scrum feed by Aaron Smith. Stable scrum. Pass goes out to Manga. He again decides not to, to kick and he's also down at the moment. So the All Blacks in really big trouble very early on in this game. They've now lost the likes of Ardi Sevilla and now losing Richie Moanga as well. And a chance for Brett Cameron to come on. Crouch. Big moment for the young guy Mind. as he makes his debut for Sit. the All Blacks. Another great feat from the All Blacks. They need to get out of their own 22. Now Brett Cameron takes it up. He gets thumped in the tackle. His first touch on debut. Release. All Blacks still going up field, not kicking. Now Bowden Barrett has found some space at the back. Trouble here for South Africa as Mapimpi needs to go back. Oh, Barrett is chasing him down. Good defense from Bowden Barrett. Now the kick downfield by Faf de Klerk. He's chasing his own kick. It's only Locks at the moment chasing this down. Now White Lock gets tackled in the process. Good, de good uh, defense from Faf de Klerk now. Brett Cameron out to Severis, intercepted by Mapimpi. But a wild pass takes the All Blacks into possession now. Chance for Aaron Smith with the kick downfield. Finding plenty of space in between now at the moment. Now Dialeni, he gets driven back in a tackle. And it looks like he's also down injured. Yep, it's definitely a knee injury for Damien Dialeni. And a chance Crouch. for Francois Stein to get another Fine. test cap to his name. Set. So plenty of injuries very early in this game. 20 minutes gone, no score. Chance now for South Africa to attack. Out it goes to Lukanya. Um, finds Billy Leroux. There's plenty of space for the Springboks here. Yeah, oh, Billy Leroux should have passed the ball. But the South Africans still on the attack. Now Sia Khaleesi. Offloads to Nkosi. Good cover Police. defense by the All Blacks. Now Fab de Klerk out to Kutsov to Stein. Now Mapimpi with a little chip kick over the top. Chase down 
but good defense from Jack Goody. Now long pass out there to Leonard Brown. Good defense Release. from South Africa. We could have a turnover ball now. Now Dwayne Vermeule back inside it goes to Pollard. South Africa still in possession. Now Ibanezabeth beats one. Still in possession is South Africa. Now Peter Steff the Tway charges up. South Africa still have possession now. They go blind. Back inside to Stain. Great little offload to Bonambi. Back to Etzebeth. Inside to Kalisi. Now South Africa on the attack. Five meters from the line. Now the Clerk out to Francois Stein. Pollard, quick hands required. And Kossi is going to go over for the first try of the game. Brilliant piece of play by South Africa there. And they capitalize on some terrible mistakes from the All Blacks. Well, great little build up there by the Springboks. And then just quick hands out to the to the wing and he goes over for the first try here at Eden Park. South Africa haven't won at Eden Park in so many years. This is the fortress of the All Blacks. But could it all change today? Andre Pollard with the conversion. It's seven points to nil. South Africa lead. 36 minutes gone into this game. Now the restart by Barrett. Taken up by Bonambi. He throws a loose pass. Collected by Am. Now Vali Leroux offloads to Kitsov. Kitsov beats one. Another nice offload to Bonambi. And the Springboks now finding holes at the moment. Turned over by the All Blacks though. Another turnover from Etzebeth. And more space for South Africa on the outside. Now Pollard throws it into Malherbe. He goes to ground. Quick reset ball for South Africa. Taken up by Etzebeth. Beats another defender. Turnover from the All Blacks. Now trouble here. We all know how dangerous they are from turnover ball. Sever is on the attack. Good defense from up in peace. Now the All Blacks in the, on the 10 meter line of South Africa. Great little pass from White Lord. It's Taylor who finds a bit of space. Turnover by the box again and now. Chance here. Francois Stein. Release. South Africa managed to recover possession now. And Faf de Klerk is going to thump this downfield and it's going to go into touch. So the box lead by seven points to nil in this crucial game in the rugby championship. Right, we get ready for the second half now. Bowden Barrett is going to restart this game. Two injuries to the All Blacks, one to South Africa. Punabi takes it up beautifully. Turnover ball by the All Blacks, but intercepted by Le Canyam. South Africa on halfway now. Kutsov takes it up. Throws a loose pass again there. South Africa need to control this better. Now taken it up by Kulisi. Another turnover for the All Blacks. And now they are on the attack. It's Dalton Papali'i. Turned over by Sneeman. Quick hands required now for South Africa. Great little hands from the box. Now Mapimbi with a bit of space on the outside. Good defense there. Great hands from the box at the moment. Goes to ground. Will they get this back? Yes, they will, but very slow position coming for them. Now Sneeman out to Malherbe. Great little offload to Vali Leroux. South Africa have lost possession now. And a chance for the All Blacks to attack. Good little drive up there Release. from Joe Moody as they go up to halfway. Aaron Smith with a little snipe to the left. Release. Still have possession is the All Blacks. Long pass out to Anton Leonard Brown. Now George Brick at in the tackle. And it's another turnover ball for South Africa. 
Oh, Pollard just couldn't collect that ball, but they still managed to get it back though. And little thought the cloud could go all the way. No, back inside to Francois Stein. Great running play by South Africa. Great hands. Now there's an opportunity out wide. Slow, slow ball coming. Decide to go to Famiela and back inside to Kitsov. South Africa not keeping control of possession and has lost it again. Now Severis found a bit of space. He could go all the way. Surely it's Mapimpi against Reese. Nkosi coming up for cover. They're going to get him. Beautiful defense, cover defense from Nkosi. But somehow the All Blacks have got this back. Great offload now. Chance here for Brett Cameron. But he gets thumped in the tackle. Now Aaron Smith back to Kane. Inside to La Lola. Wow, what an orthodox pass. And Severis goes in for the All Blacks first try. Well, hard to believe that a prop can do a pass like that. But he's done it. And it was really orthodox. Cameron got thumped back in the tackle there. Well, look at Laulala's pass. Backflip pass to Severis. And nobody there to tackle him in the end. So Brett Cameron is going to go for the kick at goal now. Can he get this straight through the middle? So it's game on here at Eden Park. Seventeen minutes to play. It's all square at the moment. Good kick off from South Africa. Beautifully taken by Rees. Oh, they're making some phenomenal passes at the moment. Release. Now Smith with the charge. Release. It's a bit great defense from him. Now Pollard makes the tackle. Good defense Release. on Sam Kane as well. Lalala drives it up. Nearly losing possession there. Bit isolated. But now another opportunity. Oh, Leonard Brown should have got that out to the wing. Just got caught before he could actually do the offload. On the 10 meter line of the All Blacks. Great tackle from South Africa. Now John here as they turn it over. But the All Blacks have somehow managed to get this back. Nine minutes to go. Chance now. Long cutout pass to Guru. Puts it downfield. Valila Ruse in position. Oh, but a thumping tackle on Billy LaRue has put them under pressure. Now Dwayne Vermeulen takes it up. Oh, terrible pass there by Vermeulen, but the ball goes back. Release. And another chance now for the All Blacks. Australia stole the game last time round. This time it's a penalty against Cody Taylor for not releasing on the ground. So chance to relieve some pressure I don't believe it's in his distance maybe give to Stain now they decide to go for touch though oh and a terrible kick from Andre Pollard there not gaining too much ground at all so more replacements now coming on for the All Blacks with two minutes to go can Bunambi get this throw correct Throw in, finds it's a bit nicely done. Now South Africa forms the mall. Not going anywhere at the moment. Now cuts off. He throws it out to Peter Step the to a hundred Pollard. Now Francois staying out to Lukanya. Arms found a bit of space. Do we still have possession? Yes, we have. Now Peter Step the to a pass out to stay. Now Archias Neyman with a bullet going run downfield. Now Mulherbe. Great little offload to Faf de Klerk. And still South Africa on the attack now. Francois Stein has dropped back into the pocket. Will he get this? It's going, it's going straight through. South Africa's got the win here. Got to see of a Francois Stein drop goal. Beautifully done. And that's what experience can do. Brilliant timing on the drop goal and South Africa has stolen this game here at Eden Park tonight. 
absolutely nail-biting stuff there towards the end and South Africa might have just secured the championship now probably only need another good victory and they will be home and dry until next time guys this is the rugby guru just for now